Through your Territorial Army training, you will have the opportunity to learn a wide range of valuable skills. There are over 140 different jobs available, so everyone can find a role that fits, which could also help with your civilian career. All TA soldiers complete Phase 1 basic training. This is normally spread over several weekends, midweek training evenings and a final two-week course. The number of weekends you will have to attend differs on whether you are infantry or non-infantry. The training starts with an induction course held either at your unit or a regional training centre called the TA Foundation Scheme or TAFS. This course, held over two weekends, is an introduction to the TA and its ethos and includes an interview, a basic fitness assessment and, of course, your uniform. The training weekends and evenings cover basic core military skills, including weapon handling, field craft, physical training, battlefield first aid and map reading, to name but a few. But before progressing to the final two-week stage of Phase 1 training, you'll have to pass various tests. You should now be ready for Part 2 of basic training, an intensive two-week training camp held at one of the Army training centres. This tests you on what you've learnt so far and also advances your basic core skills. I was apprehensive because you just don't know what to expect, but everybody's really friendly and helpful, so everybody's pulling together. I've got to know each other well, you know, even in the first day. Everyone's been great, uh, they've been very helpful. This course ends with a four mile march with kit, which has to be completed in one hour. <laughs> Feeling absolutely knackered, but good. Good, really, real sense of achievement. I felt brilliant as I didn't think I could do it back on, but you push yourself and you feel brilliant after. The successful completion of the course marks the end of basic training. You are now a TA soldier and join the passing out parade with the rest of your group. A very proud moment for all recruits and their families. The Army does open a lot of jobs, opportunities. That's what employers are looking for, the dedicated person who's been in the Army. There's so many different benefits of this course. Um, you've got the personal challenge, you're being pushed all the time, you're learning new skills, you're learning teamwork. The instructors were actually brilliant and I'm not just saying that because they're stood next to me. The TA also welcomes ex-regulars and the experiences that they bring. It's usually possible to enter the TA at the previously held rank. Next is Phase 2, Trade Training, where you will learn specific skills dependent on your chosen job and the requirements of your unit. This could mean picking up a completely new skill or expanding on your current civilian area of expertise. Sports and adventurous training is also an important part of TA life, building self-confidence and developing vital teamwork and leadership skills. At the end of Phase 2, and with an element of collective training, you will be available for active service if necessary, and you should feel confident of getting stuck into anything the TA asks of you. For more information on becoming a Territorial Army soldier, visit your local Army Careers Office or TA Centre. To find the one nearest to you, visit armyjobs.mod.uk.